So the players union in uh, Major League Baseball now, it seems, is influencing Albert Pujols. Now people are saying, well, how can you influence Albert Pujols? Because if you take low end money from your the team you're on already, it hurts everybody else's marketability. That's why they're asking for $300 million, uh, dollars, $30 million a year, which by the way, I would never pay. But that being said, the union's denying this. Well, how can you deny it when Jim Tome wanted to accept, re- allegedly and reportedly, a deal from the team that brought you through the ranks? drafted you, nurtured you, okay? And then you wanted to accept money from them and play for them, but it was 15 million less than the Philadelphia Phillies were offering. Guess where Jim Tomey ended up playing? And he didn't really want to. He had a year in Philadelphia, okay? But he made more money. The union basically did their job, but Jim Tomey was pressured by his own union to sign for more money with the Philadelphia Phillies, to, to be with the people, and this isn't like Jim Tomey, I know this, Jim Tomey would have stayed with the Cleveland Indians. I mean, I'm just saying, brought to you by my guy, Mike Fisher at Great Lakes Garage Builders. Get your garage reservation in today.